Waldorf's Journey. Isn't that one of the Muppets? Oh. Okay, it's a walrus. He is an Amy Reticle. Oh no, it's Jump King. Oh no. Oh my god, that jump is ridiculous. I don't think we're long for this game. Welcome to Princess Penguin's Provisions. Ooh, we could get a balloon. Slow down gravity for a while. A few seconds of precision flying. Can I just buy both of these? Yeah, why wouldn't I do that? <laughs> you. The rage clips. Oh god! No, oh, fly you fuck! Why are you looking up? Oh, I wanted to talk to him. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, it's a checkpoint. Okay. That's not so bad. Dogs can't look up. I don't think that's true. Famous last words. What's up, Ace? No, there's a key there. Best, 25%. I think we can maybe do better. Here we go. Okay. Harpoon. Pull yourself towards a ledge. Safe way to test out your jumps. How do you use other items, man? Just go back to sleep forever. I wish. Oh, you have to choose it. <laughs> That's so stupid. Oh, man, you only get one? <laughs> no, 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 no. is that don't do it I knew it no
I don't like Jump King, and I'm not a fan of that either. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I forgot to read the stuff. Shit. Okay, I'll read them after. Corgi. Subnautic Venture. Adventure. Vishmi is a marine biologist. One day she noticed something strange. The animals of the ocean were acting very aggressively toward her. She quickly returned to research the research station to report her findings. Ishmi knew she needed to understand why the animals were acting this way. She equipped her new submarine Porgy with stun torpedoes and set out. Together, they would get to the bottom of this mystery. Something strange is going on in the ocean. Let's go find out what's upsetting the fish. We haven't found any cool gear yet. Let's head back out there and get some. So this is Dave the Diver, right? Oh, you bitch. So as far as I can tell, there's actually no reason to fight shit. Because they're not giving me anything to pick up. They're not doing anything cool. Got it. So just explore, grab shit, and go back to base to install. Understood. Okay. A chill just went up my spine. I don't like this, a chill just went up my spine. It's freaking me out. Fuck, man. God, everything in this ocean sucks. Glad those came out of literally nowhere. Ugh. At least you keep what you had. Like, oh, is it? Is that supposed to tell me that a shark's nearby? The chill is up my spine or whatever?
Okay. Oh my god. Grab that. This seems like bad news to be down here. I'm so fucking dead. This ain't your mod pod, Dave the Diver. My ma and pa, Dave the, Di Dave the Diver. Oh, I'm so fucking dead. Yeah. Yup. Things don't stay dead either, right? Like between runs, I'm pretty sure they come back alive, they respawn. So there's like legitimately just no point in attacking and killing stuff. So I need something to be able to open up that pathway. Is that not a thing I can do anything with? I guess not. Snake this back to the headquarters. Go away, you clown fish. Must be like an actual good piece of equipment somewhere. This is where the shark is. Oh my god! Just can't hurt this thing at all with this. Takes like no damage. You fuck off, you little shit. All right, I want a better weapon. This weapon blows assholes. Thank God it doesn't actually take away from your fuel, like everything else seems to. I mean, I could try fighting this thing. here now.
I hate everything in this fucking ocean. I hate every single fucking fish. <laughs> I hate it so much. There it is. Rematch, bitch. Let's go. Where is he? Oh my god, there he is. I need more powerful ammo. Would suck if we were to accidentally get polluted. Dude, as soon as we get out of this ocean, I'm going to tell all the oil companies the area that they can dump in. Every single one of them. Oh, right. Only when it goes up and down. God damn it. I'm annoyed because I feel like I'm one weapon upgrade from this game opening up. And like, maybe I'm just like fooling myself with that thinking. That crab is a real piece of garbage. Like in a collection of 50 games, I should really just pass by this one. Because I already kind of hate it. Like I said, I feel like I'm one decent upgrade away from this becoming not the worst. Rate inducers? Oh, rage inducers? No, 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 no. Some of the games are really, really good.
my god. You know what would help if I could shoot straight down? Fucker, you motherfucker. There's another base here. Okay. I mean, that's good. I guess. Look at this little fucker. Whoops. Please let there be something over here. Like, I obviously need upgrades to be able to enter some of these areas, but I haven't seen anything. Try this again. This time, I guess, going straight down. there's something down here. That looks promising. Buster torpedoes. All right, let's do it. Go back up. Choose two. How? How do I use the buster torpedoes? Or are they just equipped? What can that open? Oh my god. I'm guessing it just does more damage, maybe? Nope. the fucking buster torpedoes do i'm guessing they just break certain blocks open
There's no difference at all in the way they look. Which is what's throwing me off. Come up here, you little shit. What blocks can these open? I honestly don't think I even have them equipped. But I don't know how the hell you would equip them. There we go. Jesus Christ. Shit. Well, it definitely does more damage. short range though. I don't know, man. Doesn't do anything there. These maybe? No. Nope. Go fuel up again. I don't know about this game. I'm really, really trying to give it a fair shot, but I am not enjoying this at all. <laughs> I'm just not enjoying this one at all. Jesus. Whoops. Right on this. Okay, so that blows up that. Got it. So we'll probably blow up those, I assume. Whoops. Oh, I need another one. Oh, Christ. God damn it. Okay. It's eerily quiet now. Big egg. Let's return them to their home. 
Why? Oh, fine, fuck. So it can turn into another giant thing that wants to fucking kill me? Wow, that shit locks you in here. shark is there. Where the hell does this egg go? Guessing to this thing. I'm guessing that's where. Okay, well. If you find my babies, could you bring them home? Well, that's where the eggs go. There's that fucking shark. There's that giant octopus too. No, you fucker, dude. Just go away. I hate this. <laughs> I hate you all so much. God. <laughs> that doesn't feel like any difference at all. Oh, 
Oh, there's another egg. many eggs there are. Also, I wonder if there's anything worthwhile down here. What? so fucking dead. We're done with that. Holy shit, what a bad game. Fuck Porgy. Onion delivery. Right, I forgot to do these. The game's protagonist was based on a stuffed walrus one at Frankie's Family Fun Center. February 1986 for Waldorf's. Porgy. March 1986, the first title released under the new UFO Soft brand. Onion Delivery. April. The directorial debut of programmer Ch Chiffon Bola, who once had a job as a delivery driver. should be a pleasant day with minimal danger or strangeness. How boring. Oh my god. The control on this. Holy shit. Uh. I don't actually understand how this controls. Oh, you have to hold it down. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is so fucking hard to control. Horde of Zombies apparently uh, appeared last night. Sudden, so, oh, okay, whatever. I guess we're back on it. Oh my god.
god. Yeah, we're done with this one too. Really, really don't like that one. Caramel Caramel. The camera ability was lifted from one of Chun's cancelled projects, a side-scroller called Photo Mom, May 1986. Prologue, huh? On the second day of Juniper. Oh! Am I supposed to be reading that? I'm heading out on a galactic adventure. So we got a camera shmup here. Is that something? It is something. Okay. Weird. Okay. I think I understand. Snack Planet. Hell yeah. Oh, so those are attacks. Okay. Ah, you can freeze shit in it too. Got it. Honestly, a pretty fun little shmup. I just sucked ass there. Pretty cool, though. Pretty cool little mechanic. Oh, my. Get a picture of it. Hell yeah. Maybe I go down this time? Oh shit.
Fuck. I wish I moved a little faster. A speed up would be really nice. This music's really good too, actually. I just noticed. It's fun. Okay. I can't waste it. I need to get this stupid cookie. Motherfucker. All right. Cool game, but I'm getting pissed off, so we gotta move on. Many of the game's party goers were based on our friends and family. Party house. Okay. Get this party started. Party is getting out of hand. Oh, God. Trouble. All right, we got to end party. Shit was getting out of hand too quick. So I have five popularity. Boot out one guest, security. Let's add a rich pal. Okay. I'm gonna throw another party. Plus one cash, nice. Plus one popularity. Plus two popularity. Party's almost full. Party is full. Okay. What do you give? One pop. He get next gift. Two. Okay. Let's do that. That's good. And we'll expand our house. Six now. If full house plus five popularity minus one cash. What do you bring? Three population, two cash. Okay. Let's do it. We can expand the house more. Nine popularity for that, huh? 
cancels one trouble. Okay, that's good. Party's getting out of hand. Oh no, the cops showed up. Shit. Who gets the blame? Uh, the old friend, of course. Temporarily banned for one party. Okay. Okay, we got it in the party. Boot. Let's just end while I can. I have too many troublemakers in my lineup. Add another couple hippies, I guess. Okay. Let's try this. Nice. Okay, now I think we can get an auctioneer. Shit. For that cash flow. Cause I gotta make this house bigger. Okay. That's good. No dogs? Really? Okay. Oh, crap. Okay, that's fine. Need a hippie. Nice. Need more money, though. Popularity is not really becoming an issue anymore. That seems pretty good. Let's get a few of those. Etch a specific guess seems pretty good. Let's bring an auctioneer in. Hell yeah. Need that money. So we can make the house bigger. Boot out one guess. Security. Minus one popularity plus two cash. Oh my. Okay, we need a hippie. troublemakers coming around. Do. 
Get four stars in a single party to win. What do I want? I need more money. Okay, that should be enough to upgrade again. Bring all the money makers out. More rich friends, that's what we need. Too much popularity, not enough money. At some point, we're just going to try to buy everybody, right? We have too many troublemakers. Uh, did I have a dog here? What do we have coming up? Oh, that monkey's going to destroy everything I've built. We got to end the party. Unless, can we boot him? Monkey was booted. Yeah, shit, the cop showed up. He's getting the blame, Monkey. Monkey's an idiot. It's all his fault. Oh my god. These monkeys are troublemakers. Don't bring a monkey in. Good, okay. Party chilled out. Two hippies, hell yeah. Okay. I think we need to buy another hippie. I think I need a hippie. I might be fucked. Another hippie. Boot. 
you. What do we want? One minus one popularity, more cash. Sure, that's fine. Monkey coming in? Sure. Okay. That dancing bonus, though. Okay. Another dog coming in. Um, can we boot himself out? Hell yeah. God, it's nothing but dogs. This party is nothing but dogs. Can we bring in more dancers? Get that crazy dancing bonus? Yeah. One, two, three, four. So we have four dancers. Are there any more dancers? No, I think that's all of them. Bring you. Plus 16, though. Holy shit. Who let dogs in the party? I guess me? I don't know. A comedian. Ugh. Comedy in this day and age? How delightfully ironic. Okay. What do we have coming up? Comedian, huh? Security guard boots himself. Oh my god, I need more dancers. I think this might be only two dancers. I need more money. We have one hippie. We have two troublemakers. Okay. We're good for trouble. I think I might take out some of the caterers. So close. Okay. Party house. 
pretty interesting. Hot foot. May 1986, based on an actual children's game played by Smolsky and Chun in elementary school. Rizik. <laughs> Picked last. I'm gonna play hot foot, no crossing the line, no throws above the knee. Let drinks and leap over beanbags to power up. Each of you has a special throw and a special action. Gotcha, bitch. I'll take... Oh. I was gonna say I'll take that, but apparently I will not. God damn it, there's a delay when you're picking up. You can't jump. God, he got me. Damn it. That was my teammate. Wow, my teammate's a piece of shit. This is worse, Windjammers. True. That could be fun with uh, some friends, though, I would say. I could see that being fun with some friends. Divers. December 1986. A second of two underwater games released. Oh, God. Okay. What? Hmm. 
What the fuck is this? This is making me claustrophobic. I don't like this. Being in dark water is the fucking worst. Oh my god. Regains 115 health. Get me the fuck out of here. All right, we're done with that game too. Rail heist. We are a strange family. An abandoned mine is our home. Dodger was orphaned at the age of eight. The sole survivor of the great disaster at Armadillo's End. Brand always hides his face and babbles in his sleep about angels and demons. That's me on guard duty next to Mr. Blue Hour Horse. My name's Maria. That's all you need to know. Brand is our leader. She took us in when we had nowhere else to go. She doesn't get around much these days, but she's the one who taught us our trade. Hold up to load your gun. Oh. Rats. <laughs> I'm going to have to retry that. They auto kill you. Out of bullets. Oh no. I have made a grave mistake. So I only have two bullets. Got it. There's no way to do it that way then. Got it. You have to go this way, huh? Got it. Look at that horse running animation. Break floor. Okay. 
Again, two bullets, huh? Mr. Blue. Okay, that's fine. Got it. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. No, that guy's there still. I forgot. Shit. Forgot about that asshole. Probably can't reach that, right? Oh, right. I need to break that wall. And I just loaded my gun, so I'm fucked now. Yeah, there it is. Okay. And yeah, this game is neat. I agree. I didn't mean to pick the box up. What the fuck? Whoops. God, that's so fucking stupid. I'm trying to hit the block below it, but it's not letting me. That is not what I meant to do.
Uh oh. Uh oh. Hell yeah. Eat it. Yeah, easy. Exactly. Yeah, I was wondering if that would be instant death or not. It is. God. I'm fucked. <laughs> yeah, I'm fucked. Easy. I don't know where the other ones are, so I'm worried. Okay, got it. I'm just gonna wait here. Wait, he's knocked out. I think I still have to wait though. For him to come up this ladder to pop him in the head. sides. Just gotta wait, I think. Oh, 
No, oh, it's done. Or not? Hello? Wow, this is fucking stupid. Should have just gone for it. We're paid A3 now. Yeah, that's right. This one's not dead yet, though, which means I'm done. I lost. Shit. Shit. Oh, I didn't mean to auto fire on that dude. You gotta be looking away. Oh god. What a fucking whiff. the ladder all right easy
Oh god damn it. No! What? No! The turn ended when I jumped. Fuck off. What a bunch of bullshit. Dick. God, that dude's looking right over here. Oh, I'm fucked. There's no way I get out of this. Yeah.
Oh, I should have just been looking ahead. I would have got him. I feel like I need more ammo. I don't think there is any on this this place either. now. Shit. He's gonna kill me again. God damn it. Oh, okay. That's fine. Asshole. Oh, it doesn't count. Fuck. Okay. I'm done with this anyway. That's a cool game. That's a neat one. Vanger. Ooh. R. Vanger, creation of the Mercenary Corporation Ward Genus, Inc. Wakens from stasis on mechanized moon Io. Only to find that the base has been compromised by unknown forces. A virus has turned all systems blind to allegiance. Vanger, I barely know her. Our Vanger's only home has been made into an enemy. Whoever is responsible for this must be found and eradicated. Alright, let's go. Let's just play. Ah, this is the, um, this is the Metal Storm game. Sick. Security systems have turned against me. I must find the cause. Extended senses allow it to see it further by looking up or down for a brief time. Got it. Cooper told me to restrict access to the lower levels using the explosives. He seemed nervous. Jorgensen. Hey, 
I obviously don't have the power up I need for that type of floor yet. suit for that. So far, probably to the surprise of nobody, this is easily one of my favorite games that's in this collection. <laughs> My god, that's so difficult to get the feel of. There oh, there's a door there. I was like, is there seriously nothing here? Shield upgrade. Ooh, what should we do with the shield upgrades for the Vanger armor? Just leave them be. We should lock the flexi mods in the armory until the breach is closed. Healed, huh? Where's it continue from, though? Oh, here. Just enough to ensure all my progress is gone. This is a game that if this was out on the NES, I would have played the shit out of. Grab the shield again. Oh my god. 
an annoying enemy. Can't get through here, though. Oh, you can just jump through them, right. So I can do this. This way. Okay. Thank God, another checkpoint. Module H has been secured in the armory. I'll finish installing the gene pod on the lower level. There's no way I get through there without dying. I don't think. Oh my god. Jesus. Eight jumps. can barely just barely not reach it to say well that can't be good some sort of latin heat mod okay this allows us probably to go in that hot area then, I assume.
Is this a gene pod? Yeah. Oh, weird. You can equip it to different parts. So, flip to fire hot wave, body defense up, heat resistance, or gun, attack up and flame bullets. Yo. That's pretty cool. This game's awesome. Finally, another game that just screams me, you know? Another game that, like, finally I would be super stoked as a kid if this was a thing. Feels like it's been a while since I've found another one of those in this collection. Doesn't make sense to keep Epsilon in stasis right now. What is Hooper thinking? UFO for me. That's right. The new security droid is ready for testing. Codename Cockroach. The thing is huge. Sounds like a boss fight. No time to disable the teleporter, just block it with an explosive, hope for the best. There they, Sector. Sector. Maiden's droids in Zone 2 are acting up again, mind taking a look. Homer, I don't know if you saw my message. I just want to reiterate, I don't really care if you don't stream on YouTube. The only reason I brought it up was um, that specific type of stream I think would go really well on YouTube. Like the niche, the magic niche, that's all. And that plugin I'm using right now, in fact, makes it extremely easy. Ah, uh, that took some brain power. This scares the shit out of me. <laughs> Yeah, you're not supposed to. I tried going in the outdoor. You never want to do that. Don't want to go in the outdoor. Strange, I'm trying to access the zone 2 droid control system. It's locking me out. Up. 
Ooh. I obviously need something that can go through these walls, I think. So that I can hit that. I don't have whatever you need for that yet. Oh well. Alright, so not that way. Got it. You couldn't look down in this game, dude. Holy shit. so much. <laughs> I'm going. Fuck it. That's what I'm looking for. Hell yeah. Oh, thank God. Bioways processing facility ahead, level one security clearance required. Fight. 
I know one's coming soon. Just a shy little guy, that's right. sucks. Level one access granted. Well, that was easy. This will 100% be a boss fight. I feel it in my bones. Still nothing, huh? Bring Wive Anger online, start testing capabilities in battle simulations. Okay, so they flip with me. Got it. kidding me what an asshole Okay. 
so you can't flip on the X's. Got it. How do I access my map? I can? There must be something that negates that, that I don't have. Level five clearance. Got it. do that either. The music is very cheerful, yeah. Obviously missed something before coming in here. Too far ahead, I guess. You know what? I probably should have gone to that flame area. I bet I'm not even supposed to be in this sector yet. Not even supposed to be here. That's right. I knew I should have just played more Dead Rising. <laughs> it's just the go-to. Go-to now is just Dead Rising. Friendship with Resident Evil over. Dead Rising is my new best friend. There's nothing here, right? Yeah, I can't get through there. Legitimately, I should have played Resident Evil 3 today, though. Because the start of that game starts on September 28th. 
my one chance every year to play it at the right time, and I missed it. This is where I'm supposed to be. <laughs> Remember how I kept saying I feel there's a boss fight coming on? I completely skipped it, apparently. Now I can't play for another year. Exactly. Because that's the way it works. That's the way. This doesn't seem right. Is this where the heat area was up here? It is. Boy, I wish I had a checkpoint area though to put on my fire resistant. off my damage because the fire increases your attack damage. Get out of here though without without the fire thing equipped. Oh, 
No, I'm fucked. There's gotta be another checkpoint. Maybe here? Yes, okay, good. So I gotta move this over to this. Should not be nearly as scary now. It's get the switching like polarity thing being a double jump is a uh, really bad feeling, honestly. And I know it's because it's like there's two buttons that they could use, but goddamn, it feels so bad. Base, four key codes, hide them. Got it. Got it. Okay. So this was all for nothing. Got it. I understand. I don't know which way I want to go about this. I guess this way. So I just went around in a circle, huh? Alright. We're done with this game for now. 15%.
Almost canceled due to the technical and other developmental challenge. Development challenge. Rock on Island. Number 30. For years, the humans and dinosaurs of Rock on Island lived in harmony, but one day a mysterious pink UFO passed overhead and dropped a strange object on the island. Four dinosaurs, the strongest of their tribes, found the object. When they touched it, it gave them the curse of intelligence. They decided to drive the humans away by attacking their caves. One by one, the humans were driven out until only the village, only the village of peace remained, Zola. The young chief of the village took over command of the remaining humans. She vowed to take the island back. Okay. It's a tower defense, isn't it? Oh, maybe not? Can I place something down? Start wave. I feel like I should be able to put down defenses or something. Is there anything else I can do? Okay, so did I buy them? Can I use them now? Or was it just on that one screen? Yeah, why can't I get these fuckers in the other stage?
shit. Stood too far out, I guess. Okay, now that that's done, can I actually have... There we go. Okay. I don't know what a campfire does. Peasy so far. Give some of these guys some actual weapons. Okay. Go again. Wow, those saber tooths are quick. Quick. I should put that there. Get rid of that. Whoops. Shit. Little bastard got me. Okay. Oh, wow, those dudes are tough. Thank you. 
Okay. Pretty standard little tower defense game. I do like a good tower defense. I wonder if it, this actually gets like crazy eventually. Hard to tell when you're only on stage one. That is a lot of shit coming. Oh shit, I walked into the path again. This is everything, huh? Why you fuck? Oh. Jesus. So close. Is this just the same things I can save cave same cavemen and everything? I'm guessing. Do you eventually get other units? Spears are strong, but you can throw rocks quick. Okay. Bows can shoot arrows. Okay, I don't have bows yet. So yeah, there are different... Oh, you can upgrade again. Okay, got it. I didn't try doing that. That makes sense. That makes sense. Wheel.
That seems like a waste what I just did there. Yeah, I shouldn't have done that. Fuck. What a waste. I want to try upgrading one of these fools and see what he does. 30 is pretty steep, though. restart this. This is fucked. Try this again. How much is this to dig? And fuck. Setup's a little fucked up, honestly. I want to see how Rock 2 does. Rock 2 attacks pretty fucking quick. they not hit because of this? Are they getting like line of sighted? That map sucks so hard. I just realized I thought this was the this is the entrance over here oh for fuck's sakes okay Keep them over there, I guess.
Oh, shit. Okay. I don't want to see what wheel is as well, but. Okay. This is where I need spears for these guys. The stronger attack. This is going to hurt. They're not going to be able to kill it, a single one. Rough. Oh shit, I walked into it. And this is the end. Yeah, you just need fucking numbers, man. Going for like upgraded units is garbage until later. You just need to fill up the board with a bunch of shit. Okay. Yeah, God, those guys are so rough. So much health.
Okay, well, getting a little closer. Shit. No, oh, it's over. Fucking rough, man. Holy shit. Did I read about this? Originally, the cavemen were supposed to move around, but it was too hard to design and program. <laughs> You know what? I forgot to check up on pilot quests this whole time. I'm not used to there being like an auto clicker thing in here. Whoop. Can't we do something with five? There we go. Another house. Oh, I have two mates. Does that give me double the time? It does. Okay. So going in with more meats is kind of the play by the looks of it. Maybe one time I spend my full allotment 2,500 on uh, five meats. Just see how much good shit I could get in here. Wow, that was not... That juice was not worth the squeeze. Holy crap. So not worth it. Or that. There's some Zora ass motherfucker in here too. Yeah, him. If you guys could drop, like, anything else. Man, all they're dropping is the like shit you get over time by just waiting i'm i lost everything i fucked up i don't think i can get back out no gg god damn it what a waste of fucking time that was holy christ Twenty ingots, huh? For that stuff? Damn it. As cool as this is, I don't think I'm ever gonna finish this. I don't think there's any way. God damn. That thing. There's so much in that game. That there is to do. Holy crap. 
on the plus side, we're over half done looking at the game, so that's cool. So far, so good.